What's up guys, my name is Ozzy and welcome back to a brand new video on the official Nitro Luke DX channel. Now we're coming at you today with 10 things that you may not have known about the parrot. Now a little bit ago the parrot came to the PC platform of Minecraft as an update but I know that there's going to be loads of different things that we haven't heard of and loads of you guys haven't heard of so we're going to be bringing you the facts and the things you may not have known about these parrots. So without further ado, make sure that we absolutely destroy that light button right now. I'm destroying it, destroying it. So there we go. I just did it. Make sure to smash that like button down below. It lets me and Luke know if this is the sort of direction that we should go in with content. And every single like means that you guys want to see more of these sorts of videos. So destroy it, destroy it, kill it. Just tap the like button. We don't want any injuries in the making of this video. I like to do all these videos with a little bit of an Xbox vibe. That's why we're on the Xbox. I feel like we've got better skins, better things to play with. And we will do various little shots and clips from the PC to show you guys these things in detail. But the first thing that you may not have known about these cat parrots in Minecraft is the fact that they come in five colors. Okay, not four, not one, not two, but five exact colors. So we'll go for them now. We got red, as you can see, our amazing pre-made built in Xbox parrot. Uh, green, blue, gray, and cyan. These are the main colors that have been added into the Minecraft platform of PC. Now there will be some different sort of colors coming in the future, I assume, because there's plenty more parrots colors that I've seen before and they could definitely add some multicolors together, mix them together, add a little bit of that style and mix to the game. But that is the first thing you may not have known and onto the next one. Next thing guys is the fact that the parrots in the game will actually go around and imitate what other mobs say. Like as a hostile mob is in front of you, if you've got a parrot with you, it will actually imitate as it's looking at this mob. Like, say you're just walking around, doing your business, blah, 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 and there's a mob somewhere near you, the parrot stares at this mob and will actually do a higher pitch version of the sound of any hostile mob. So say, if it was a zombie, it would kind of be a higher pitch groan, and the hiss of a creeper will be amplified a little bit as well. So it's almost like a sensor of mobs, some, some sort of like spy that can find mobs near you. And it obviously links into what parrots do in real life because they copy what you say sometimes. Various different species do that sort of thing. So I like that they've added this into the game to add a little bit of realistic Minecraft qualities into the game. Realistic Minecraft, hashtag our series on our channel, check it out. And on to the next Thing you may not have known. Now, I found a skin which actually represents like how you have parrots in Minecraft in quite a good way on the Xbox version. Obviously, on the PC version where there actually is parrots, you do get them on your shoulders. And we'll be showing clips of that throughout the video. So don't you worry about that. But I thought this skin suited it perfectly. Anyways, on to the things you may not have known. A little hint about how parrots were even going to be involved in Minecraft at all was actually leaked around the 23rd of March of 2017, so this year. And it was from the developer, Maria, who actually tweeted out that she was developing a brand new mob and it was going to be Fly-tastic. And now, obviously, we have got the parrot, and that's where the hints started from this developer, if you guys did not know that. Okay, guys, so the next thing that these... Oh, oh my goodness, did you see that? I, like, a ghost is following me, but the next thing that these parrots are actually based on in the game are real-life parrots in the world. In the real life world. So parrots such as the macaws and the cockatiels are actually what the developers decided to theme the Minecraft parrots from. And they said they added a little bit of a Minecraft twist. So they're not identical parrots to the real life. But I like the fact that we've got a little bit more of originality in the Minecraft games so that they're not complete copy and pastes and they still add that bit of a Minecraft style. So that is what these 
actual parrots were based on in the world and something that you guys may not have picked up on. Alright, so there's actually a little bit of a funny twist on how parrots are tamed in Minecraft, okay? Now, it's not by, like, getting them to fly down at you and being very cautious, getting them to sit next to you. With, like, just like the ocelot, it's quite a, an intense sort of taming process. But when it comes to the parrot, they've added something which I don't really know what to think about this because in real life, it is actually toxic for parrots to eat any sort of chocolate or anything like that. Almost like it is for dogs. Now, in Minecraft, guess. Just take a wild guess on how you tame parrots. You just gotta, you know, feed them some chocolate chip cookies. Okay, so I think it's a little bit, obviously, of a play on the fact that they cannot eat this in the real world. And so taming them by using these lovely cookies is a little bit of a spin around and tables turning a, a approach to the taming of these parrots. So, a little bit of a twist and I think it adds that cool little Minecraft uniqueness into the game. And uh, But obviously, do not feed parrots chocolate in real life. That's all I'm saying. This is not advocating that whatsoever. But on to the next thing you may not know. Parrots will actually run away from you if you start to jump in water or should I say fly away as we can see we've got my uh, makeshift Minecraft Xbox parrot companion right here and one on my back but we'll show you a clip of how they fly away in the real platform of Minecraft with parrots and as you jump into the water they will actually not follow you which is uh, obviously understandable because parrots don't really want to be Drowning in the waters, but just a little fact if you are planning on going swimming with your parrots It cannot be done a little mini fact about these uh, parrots is the fact that they are exactly 0.5 wide with the blocks and also a one block exactly tall so as we examine this block we see it's exactly this height but half Right down the middle of this emerald block, imagine it's exactly half of that width. So you can kind of get a good idea of how big these sorts of parrots are. And they don't take up too much room. They're almost exactly the same as the one on my back, right? Now, parrots may run away when you go into the waters, but they will stay by your side when you fly yourself. So, as you can see, these parrots will actually stay on your shoulders as you're flying. Looks very unrealistic because how are they doing that? You know, they're, they're kind of sideways and it makes a little bit of a weird look. But, you know what, if it happens, it happens. I, I think it would be cool if they could actually fly alongside you. Not stay on your shoulders, but actually, you know, do some flying next to you. Fly beside you, underneath your wing, as if you're like a flock of birds flying into the distance. But I think that's quite a cool touch that they can actually stay on you with a light show. Now, parrots are actually quite invincible little fellows, okay? They do not take any fall damage. However, on the flip side, they only have three hearts, okay, and you can kill them quite easily with a few hits, and they will drop you one to two feathers. So, you know, they may have a good side of not having any fall damage, just like chickens and iron golems and stuff like that. However, they can die very easily, so make sure if you're hitting around in the air, like random, just, just watch out for your parrot, okay? Parrots also like to do a little bit of crowding. They like to all get in a pack, get their mates together, send invites out, get everyone round to the same location and crowd things. Okay, so they'll even crowd hostile mobs such as creepers. Now, I'm not sure if this will sort of trap the mob and if they're trying to do so, but it's a nice little touch that they've added in because it's a unique thing. It's a new, unique sort of feature that we've never seen before. You don't get any other mob crowding things in the game. So I like that sort of factor that they actually crowd hostile mobs and even villagers and stuff. So it's an interesting sort of thing to see in the game. And now onto the last thing. Now initially guys, there was a bug in the game which stopped loads of parrots even spawning anywhere and they were extremely rare, but they decided to remove that and make them a lot more common in the game. So if you're going into a jungle biome, you will easily find a good load 
of parrots waiting there for you. They've been waiting, they want you so badly. But that is a little fact that now parrots will be more common throughout the game of Minecraft. Please bring them to Xbox, please. That's the 10 things that we have for you today on parrots. Make sure you guys let us know in the comment section if this has at all interested you and give us some good old feedback in the comment section down below. We also love to know your thoughts on what other videos we should make. Do you have any other ideas for these sort of style videos in our content? Make sure you have liked that video, otherwise we're all gonna die because the parrot's all gonna kill us! The parrot army's after us, but... Uh, no, they're not. Don't worry. Just, just like the video. Thank you. And obviously, we do so much content here on this channel. Make sure you subscribe to see the latest and subscribe to my channel as well, maybe, because it's in the description. Please, I need you blah, 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 when I upload in the future. And also, have an absolutely amazing paratastic day. Have a great day, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye!